welcome. This is the energy vibration um, reading for the Gemini Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for this wonderful positive energies. Um, please remember to like and share us and listen to your Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. This is the fourth week of August. The week begins from the 20th until the 26th. The energy of this week is emotion, the air of the um, hermit. And from Monday until um, Wednesday, it is the energy of fire. From Thursday until Sunday, it is the energy of, uh, which is the energy of hurt. Okay. There is, um, you guys have the energy of the seven of swords. Now, some of you could be trying to get away with a situation, but it's not going to work. Okay. Um, some of you are really going to be trying to get away with a situation, but it's not going to work um the energy vibration in this week be careful what you do there's art breaks that is coming up on friday because some of you there's art break that is coming up on friday the weekend is not going to be an a, 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 a good weekend monday to thursday is going to be very positive but fridays to sunday is not going to be so positive okay so we need to um, align ourselves with that energy so um on Monday, the energy of the star, which is an air sign, this is positive. Um, a lot of you will be receiving positive news on Monday. Um, good news. Um, and this is going to be wonderful news. It's going to be good news um, of you leaving something behind. It can be a situation with a family. Some of you could be moving off and going off to school and you're standing um, strong. Um, you're um, trying to protect yourself, but yet still standing strong because you're moving out on something. Some of you could be protecting yourself from someone that is trying to get, um, um, try to do something to get um, but you you know whoever you are in this week or you're trying to do something to get away with it it's not going to happen um there is it three 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 it's not going to happen because what is going to happen is that um you're going to be trying to get away with something but it's not going to happen art breaks is going to be coming in let's look at this week and break this week down um from Friday, it's not going to be um, very positive going in the weekend for a lot of people. Um, Monday is going to be um, very positive, but for the people who are working on a lower energy vibration and working with the ego, you're going to be feeling some heartbreaks coming in, okay? And um, whatever the situation is and whatever that is a transpiring, the energy of the star and this heartbreak and the three of wands, you're leaving something behind and what this is saying is that there is um, a situation that is transpiring around you an issue that you're deciding you're deciding to just let it go and it has to do with a princess of one whoever this princess of one is um some of you are going to decide to let to release yourself from this princess of wands now this is an aries leo or a sagittarius or an obsolete person because you're realizing that this person tries to get away with something and you're going to be released them you're going to be just just automatically releasing them from you okay you're going to decide i don't need to have this person anymore in um my um surrounding and i'm letting this person go and moving away from this situation okay as we look at the middle of the week, some of you decided to leave a situation behind because it serves you no more. Some of you have some regrets, but yet still um, the energy of the family is going to be it's going to be very positive. Um, the, the energy of the family is very good, is very positive, and um, there is a connection with the energy of the, the family. So whatever the situation is, it can have to do with family situation or it can has to do with um friendship and that sort of a thing and you're going to be deciding to leave whatever it is behind you and move forward because it's not serving you anymore okay and um let's see um what is it that you're going to be deciding uh-huh there was some lies there was some lies and deception there was some lies and deception and you have found this out and this lies and deception have to do with this little girl 
um, whoever the person is the person is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius or obsolete there was some lies and deception with this person and you're going to decide to remove yourself away from this person you're going to realize that this person have been very deceptive towards you and um, you know bring you um, in a certain situation and you're going to um, block this person from your phone and you're going to decide I don't need to deal with this person now this person is between the ages of 15 to 40 15 to 40 and there was she she's very deceptive she's very deceptive she's she's very deceitful and very deceptive and you're going to decide it could be your daughter what um, your daughter have tried to do something that has broken your heart and you decided no I don't want you to be in my presence so there is coming an end to a situation an end to a family feud is coming to an end because you're standing your ground and whatever the family feud was it's coming to an end because obviously it's a family situation and there was a family feud and this little girl who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius could have um, start this family feud but it is coming to an end now okay this family feud is coming to an end because whatever the situation is um she is the cause of this situation for some of you um she is the cause of this situation for some of you you're going to realize that there was some lies and deception and this lies and deception is coming to an end and it has to do with someone who is between the ages of 15 and 40 that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius whoever this person is has been very deceptive and now um, you are removing this person away from you and um, you will no longer deal with this person and whatever they have done you're seeing it because the seven of swords is here they, they, they have done something and thought that they got away with it but it's a learning lesson because you have removed yourself from them whoever they um, were whether it's a man or a female because um, it could be a man or it could be a female whoever this person was they have been um, deceitfully set to pull you on the the bus and um, the energy of that comes to remove them once and for all all the deception and the deceitful and the lies that they've told have come out okay obviously there's a person this person is very deceptive and see this as a learning lesson but it's coming to an end a very deceptive situation the energy of the seven of swords and um, um, see it as a learning lesson because whoever um, these people are in these situation obviously this person has been very deceptive see it as a learning lesson and move yourself away from the situation so um, whatever whether it's your partner whether it's a friend whether it's a girlfriend whether it's a child whoever this Aries Leo, uh, Aries Leo or Sagittarius person is she's very deceptive move your way from a situation um, be focused and um, move forward in your life some of you will be receiving news um, from this person let them know that um, you have no interest um, to further anything with them okay and um, what we're going to do is we're going to be um, choosing a card for you guys for this week um, you know I'm very sorry for whoever um, uh, this is a fake. you people have a car car it's going to be a week that you need to have calm okay this is the back of the card you can just hold your hand like that to make yourself in calm if um because there's obviously going to be some real deceptive things and you're going to try to calm yourself okay you're really going to try to calm yourself now with this Carmen card it says um, um, stillness supports balance okay the beneficial for this card is basically reducing anxiety support masculine and feminine system cultivation instructions open your hands wide tuck your thumb in and hold your fingers over it and stretch your hands out okay caution um, for lower for lowering the blood pressure you can lower your blood pressure by just doing that and um, focus 
I rest in the calm of inner balance and support. I rest in the calm of inner balance and support. I rest in the calm of inner balance and support. So whatever is happening, and this is how you do it. This is how you do it. So this is how you do it. Okay. And you can do it like for five minutes and then, you know, breathe and then five minutes and then breathe. And this will bring you in calm. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to say thank you for being here. Namaste until next week.